Mm-hmm. Uh, can we talk about uh, the scene where um, we're introduced to Angles and you know he's back home. Uh, he's in he's in England and he's walking along and we we meet like this uh, this little urchin who's uh, she's shining shoes on the street. And she's signing the shoes of another child for a penny. <laughs> and then she's like, I'm showing you shoes, governor. Can I have me penny? And then like the kid's mom is just like, no, you little shit. Those shoes, <laughs> you, you suck at this job. And just like kicks her and walks away. And Engel sees this and he's like, hmm, oh, little girl, you can shine my shoes. <laughs> But I'll pay you. And then I was like, she had. Like, I don't care if you're not good. Yeah. <laughs> it kind of feels and, like and that's what that's what socialism is really about: making sure that the bad workers get paid too. You know what I mean? Everybody all, gets all a these, farthing. These lazy shoe shiners out here. Um, no, but then like I was, it's just like this little girl, and I was like, does she have like some like like a birthmark on her forehead or something? And then like she Engels follows her home to the you know hovel she lives in with thirty other people, and then she like tells a story about how she was you know i don't know being a uh you know factory worker. a coal eater and a uh, whatever <laughs> you know so someone they send in to like clean out the gears of yeah um some giant um <laughs> steampunk contraption yeah um and she said that she you know uh got tired at work and fell asleep on the job and like the the factory foreman uh Branded her forehead with a hot iron and then nailed her ear to a table. Nailed her ear. <laughs> Here's the thing. The, it wasn't just that the conditions are bad. It's that if you uh, get sleepy, they start crucifying you at work. <laughs> to be fair, though, I'm like pretty sure shit like that happened all the time. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah, it, it did that was happen. a casual punishment for a child. Yeah, it, it does like fit in as the perfect uh, device for the propaganda show, though, where the Chinese state comes in like, this is what it was like before. Or Mao is you would get sleepy and they would just start biting your toes off uh, as a lark. Unlike our factories now, which are perfect. Yes. <laughs> well, they, yeah, they installed the before. Yeah, in you know before Marx, there were no suicide nets. They just let, <laughs> they just, just they just out. let people kill themselves <laughs> rather than saving them and sending them right back to making your iPhone. They thought it was funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>